Chapter 6 Tools for Product and Service Design for Circular Economy In this chapter, we'll present some tools that can support the design process in the development of innovative products and services oriented to circular economy developed by the CATCH-E Consortium. The tools are independent and can be used individually without the module's information and according to the needs of each project. The tools are available for free at our website www.catche.eu From the seven tools developed within CATCH-E, three have a direct relation with the design practice. These are the CE Designer, the CE Journey, and the Catch-Up Board Game. The CE Designer is a semi-quantitative tool for prioritization, assessment, and idea finding of circular solutions for products or service redesign. The tool is organized according to eight strategies that were presented in Chapter 3. What can users expect from the application of the CE Designer? A prioritization of applicable design strategies for a specific project, the analysis of a reference product or service, immediate identification of potential improvement ideas and opportunities, background information to support creativity sessions, and a graphic comparison between the reference situation and the new developed product, service or concept. This slide shows the layout of the tool. This is the welcome page and through here the user can navigate and perform the evaluation. The tool is available for free at the project website. CE Journey the CE Journey is a tool that consists in a canvas that users can download from the website of the project and print together with playing cards. It can be used in a creative session with a group of players. It supports the players or stakeholders to assess the overall product service system journey in three stages of the life cycle – uphill, tophill and downhill. The CE journey allows the identification of opportunities to optimize the journey and to promote the circularity of the new solutions to be developed. What results can be expected? A visual canvas that allows you to see the journey and touch points of the products, producers, stakeholders and users in order to optimize the journey towards circular economy. The third tool is the catch-up board game. The objective of this game is to stimulate the users to generate value ideas from a business challenge applying circular design and circular business strategies. The game acts as a guide to get an idea about an innovative product service or to solve a real business problem and generate improvement opportunities. Like in the case of the CE Journey, the Catch-Up Board game is available for download in the project website. This tool can be applied under different situations – company, academia and workshops. By playing the game, users develop product service ideas, applying circular design and circular business strategies to solve problems with the support of several cards that guide the process and stimulate creativity. Apart from the tools developed within the Catch-E project, several other tools from external sources have been developed and are available to support the design practice for circularity. In the module you can find three examples. The Circular Economy Toolkit, the Material Circularity Indicator and the Circularity Check.
and now we propose you an exercise with the CE Designer tool. But first, you should check the tool and the tutorial in the website. You can use a specific product or service or a problem to apply the tool, or you can use the example we present in the following slide. The example is a coffee machine with a lifetime of 10 years, a capacity of half a litre and a use pattern of twice a day. It's produced and assembled in Europe. The heating components are made in Asia. The materials of the body are PP and glass. It has a single-use packaging made with cardboard, EPS and LPDE. The suppliers are ISO 14001 and SA8000 certified, this is for environmental management systems and social accountability. And the electric cables are in PVC and copper. It has a high consumption of energy in the use phase, mainly to maintain the temperature of the coffee. The end-of-life scenario is 50% of the machines are disposed in electric and electronic waste containers and 50% are wrongly disposed of by the user. Now apply the CE designer to this example. What circular solutions are you able to develop and evaluate? For further information and complete references, please consult the full text of the module.